Hey y'all, it's Liz. Hey, today I'm going to be making the best ever custard-like pumpkin pie. So if this is something that you think you might want to try for a side, you know, a dessert for tonight or even for uh, something to put on your Christmas table, then this might be the recipe for you. Okay, before we get into what you're going to need, um, you need to go ahead and preheat your oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, the first thing that you're going to need is um, a can, a 15 ounce can of pumpkin puree. You're also going to need um, one egg plus three egg yolks, which only one is showing because I broke the other two, but just egg yolks. Um, also, you're going to need one 14 ounce can of sweetened condensed milk. And then here you're going to need um, one fourth teaspoon of nutmeg, one teaspoon of cinnamon, a half a teaspoon of ginger, um, one eighth teaspoon of pumpkin spice, and also a half a teaspoon of salt. You're also going to need one deep dish pie crust, which this one's pre-made, um, but it's a deep dish. Okay, let's get started in making this custard-like pumpkin pie. Okay, to get started, what we did was we went ahead and put our pumpkin puree in a medium-sized bowl along with the sweetened condensed milk, and we're just going to mix that up and combine it, just like so. To that, we're going to add in our one egg, mix that up well, and then we're going to go ahead and throw in our three egg yolks, waste not, want not. <laughs> Okay, and we're going to combine that and mix it until it's well combined. Then the last thing that we're going to do is go ahead and add in all of our spices. And then we're going to mix this until it's well combined. And once we got this um, well combined and mixed really well, we're going to go ahead and pour it into our um, deep dish pie shell. Okay, so here's what it looks like once we pour it into our 9 inch deep dish pie shell. I went ahead and placed it on top of a pie round to catch any excess that might spill over. Um, now we're going to put this in a 425 degree oven for 15 minutes. As soon as the 15 minutes is up, you're going to reduce the heat to 350 degrees and you're going to bake that for an additional 40 to 45 minutes. Start checking on it at the 40 minute mark by inserting a knife near the center to make sure it comes out clean. If it's not clean when it comes out, bake it for another um, two minutes and continually check it after that. So I'll let you know how long it took me to cook mine and into the oven it goes. Okay y'all, my pie is done. I told you guys to start checking it at the 40 minute mark. Um, I think you might want to start checking it at the 35 minute mark. Mine went for 37 minutes and it was completely done. I did the um, knife test in two places and it came out clean. So this is what the pie looks like. So we're going to let this cool for about an hour or so. Um, and then we'll um, cut into it and see what it looks like. Okay y'all, so here is our best ever custard like pumpkin pie. And this is what it looks like. <laughs> it looks yummy. Okay, 
Well, I hope you guys try this recipe, and if you do, please um, let me know if you like it and how it turned out. Alright, bye.